Hi loves, welcome back to my channel. I am here ready to do a October favorite. And um, I'm lighting one of my favorite candles that I just got, which up next I'm actually gonna upload um, my little haul video at the White Barn. I think I'm just gonna get started with my hair because I actually have my hair out today. And um, it's looking a bit mus messy, which is how I've been wearing it lately. I have three of them that I've been using. Um, the Shea Moisture, I actually spoke about this product and how I've been taking care of my hair on my blog. So if you haven't been on my on my blog lately, please check it out. It is glamlaricious at blogspot.com. But this Shea Moisture Coconut and Hibiscus uh, product, this is specifically for curly hair. This one here, if you guys can tell, um, this is the mousse here. It's a foaming mousse and I'm almost done with this. Um, I've always been using, I've always used Herbal Essence for, um, for mousse, but I finally decided to try this, uh, brand, which you can easily find it at Target, um, either Target.com or even at Target completely, and I actually really love how the, these products really work on my hair. It makes my hair, my curls bounce a lot better, it, my hair just automatically feels so much healthier too because I'm not putting junk in there. Um, Anastasia Beverly Hills Beauty Express for brows and eyes. This um, little kit here, I've had it for a while and I found myself to be using it several times this month. So that's actually what I use today on my eyebrows and I'm sure you guys can see they look very... There are these little stencils, sorry, these little stencils with the brush. Then it has like the um, the wax here. You have the dark and the lighter um, brow color, like lighter brown or whatever. And then it has like the highlight color. The great thing about um, the highlighting colors is that one is matte and then one is shimmery. These right here, I tend to use the lighter brown a lot more than the darker one. And then today I ended up using the darker one just on the outside and um, it totally like shaped the eyebrows a lot better. Um, than what they've been looking my Too Faced chocolate bar palette on my last video and I am telling you I am obsessed I have not put in this um, Eye palette down since I got it So I'm going on to a month and a half that I've been using it and I will definitely tell you guys that I will continue using this there is the Lorac Mega Pro that I'm really like eyeing and hopefully if it comes back in stock I might get it but I'm seriously on like this saving power trip. Anastasia Beverly Hills contour kit. Um, this is sad because I seriously am like, I'm like seriously digging. Whether it's my, with my um, concealing brush or with my uh, beauty blender, I'm trying to get every little bit out of this banana powder when I know I can definitely order some, but girl, when I tell you, I am trying to save my money and I will do whatever it takes to save my money. So every last bit is coming out of that banana powder. Um, that's been a favorite. Uh, sheer Glow Foundation. I have not put it down. Like I have not even switched it. I have not used anything else and I haven't really been breaking out. Like if I break out, it'll be so this month I had a couple of like blemishes right over here that were like seriously under my skin. And then there were a couple that I've had a, over here, like a couple of very small blemishes on this side, um, but nothing serious. And um, yeah, so the NARS, I can guarantee that probably by January I need another one of these. Concealer, can't stop stressing the NARS um, Radiant Creamy Concealer in Custard. Can't stop talking about it. I totally ran out of my Maybelline um, Age Eraser or Age Erase Concealer uh, yesterday. Totally used it. I've been using that and this put together. And today I last year. And this is Lavish Living. It's like a nice purpley color to it. Um, which is perfect right now for the fall. Be my hourglass, diffuse light, and be in the ambient. Uh, I'm back to using this again since I showed you guys that on my contour kit, my banana powder has been like going to the very minimal. So I am back to using this one here. The Elizabeth and James Nirvana. These rollerball perfumes, absolute favorite. Um, can't stop wearing them. I 
combine them. I've been combining them or like using them together. They smell amazing. They have a very nice fresh and sweet scent to them uh, that I actually absolutely adore. Actually has actually been one of my lifesavers. I've been using a lot of dark lipstick colors. I don't have a favorite lipstick color. I'm not even talking about a favorite lipstick color this night because not only does it have a nice minty taste and feel on your lips, but um, I really like how it works and it definitely does conceal your lips. I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If any of these were your actual favorites or if you found something that's brand new to you that you are actually looking forward to trying, please let me know in the comments below and I will see you guys on the next video, which is going to be on a small little candle haul. So I will talk to you guys soon. Love you.